Hey Hope family, Rachel Lair here, your Kids Quest administrator from Hope Community Church. And I'm so excited to be here with you guys today, even from the comfort of my own home. Um, so my encouragement is kind of a thematic thing. Um, today I just want to talk to you about growth. And so a few events that I actually attended at Hope had kind of this correlating theme that I was able to tie together for today's message. So starting first off with Miss Jenny Allen, who was a keynote speaker at IF Gathering, she made a comment that said something along the lines of every single person in the Bible besides Jesus was broken, afraid, insecure, fearful, busy, did not have enough money, did not have enough of anything, and God moved them to change history. Now, fast forward to the Marriage XO conference. One of the keynote speakers there talked about being planted and not buried. So that really hit me because growth especially, growing pains, challenges, things that show you how strong they are, they're painful. You have to summon strength from a place you didn't even know you had it. And uh, the whole idea of being planted like a seed. So my girls and I did some planting today too, which is just driving this theme so hard home. Um, but when you plant a seed into the dirt, it feels like it's alone in the dark and doesn't understand what's going on. It might feel like it's buried. But really, just like God's the master potter and we're his clay, things are happening with the seed for it to grow. It has to do some major things, right? So another quote that hit me outside of events attended was this one by Cynthia Ocelli. And it says, for a seed to achieve its greatest expression, it must come completely undone. The shell cracks, its insides come out, and everything changes. To someone who doesn't understand growth, it would look like complete destruction. So I want to close my little message with this final idea from Psalm 71, 20, 21. You have allowed me to suffer much hardship, but you will restore me to life again and lift me up from the depths of earth. You will restore me to even greater honor and comfort me once again. So church family, as we are going through change and change brings about growth, I just want to challenge you, encourage you, lift you up and remind you that everything that brought you to the person that you are today and everything that is moving us into the future is a part of growth and growth hurts and it's challenging, but it produces fruit and it produces amazing things. So just keep growing church family in this hardship, grow up. Grow beautiful, grow strong. We've got this. Have a blessed day. Bye.